chest, baby girl, you know I don't say Why my ex don't say Why I have no say I, I get no Ali Masego It means exalted blessings I'm from the DMV. I come from a city called Columbia, and it's basically in between uh, DC and Baltimore. Uh, yeah, my dad was an R&B singer. Yeah, uh, very early on, like in elementary school, I played cello, and then from elementary school to high school, I played the trumpet. I know how to read uh, treble clef, and then after that, I started learning. Um, I started learning music technology in school. Um, well, I've always been attached to music my whole life, but when I got into high school, um, I was really into Nas, and I listened to Illmatic for the first time, and like, it really, like, it really changed my life, uh, and it made me realize that like, I could tell my story through music, and I could connect with people on a mental and spiritual level. So that's what I that's what I wanted to do through you know I want to do that through the music industry. I mean, it's just like hip hop is just so like there's so much swag. It's like it's just so cool. Like you know, every genre has its unique its unique thing. But I feel like hip hop is the most like is the most connected towards me, mm. especially with the stuff that I've gone through. Uh, well, past I would definitely say um, Nas for sure. Of course, um, Biggie and Tupac, uh, Common, the early Common, like Throwback Common. And uh, Rock Him, they were they definitely uh, they inspired me to to make sure I say something through all the songs that I put out. Um, yeah, they they were the ones that you know inspired me not to just you know not to just say anything, but with everything I say, you know, say it with say it with you know say it with something with meaning. Uh, new new artists, I definitely would say um, Young Thug, um, Travis Scott, and. Yeah, artists like that who uh, who I feel like use emotion in the music they have. So it's more than just it's more than just the rap. It's also like you know it's also you can you can feel it in how they how they execute their music. Uh, you know, people who kind of uh, people who kind of like paving the way and making music that's just for emotion. Like it's more it's more you know musical and rap at the same time. Honestly, I'd say it's a little bit of everything because um, I've been through I've been through a lot of stuff through my whole life and I just explained my story. So it's not like, you know, it's not like I'm really not like I'm really doing, you know, too much like gangster shit, too much, uh, too much like, you know, just bars. Like I'm just I'm just basically spending my life through music. Uh, well, I say I'm, I say I'm the best of both. Um, I definitely take pride in my lyrics because, you know, if you're not saying anything, then you're not really rapping. But at the same time, you know, I don't want to just spit, you know, just bars, bars, bars. I also want to make music that sounds good. So I try to put the two together. Uh, well, I'm, I'm more of a write it down type person, but don't get me wrong. I can I can spit off the dome. Um, well, I say that all rappers are artists because um, music is art in general. So, you know, just because you're not singing all the time or making songs with instruments or whatever, it doesn't necessarily mean you know you're not an artist. It's about how you put your songs together and how you how you uh, put it out on a track. Oh, uh, because I'm very into uh, I'm really into emotion in my music, and I feel like when you add the singing to it, it adds an aspect of emotion that. Sometimes you can't get through just rapping, so I try to sing some certain things that I feel like needs more emphasis on the emotion part. Of course, I'd, I'd like to get a Grammy someday, but um, yeah, I just, honestly, I just want to touch as many people with my music as I can, just go as far as I can go. Uh, definitely stay independent. Um, I, I want to be able to control everything that I'm putting out. No. Uh, Nobody else. I don't, I don't want anyone else influencing or determining how my music is put out to the people. I just want to be me through everything I do. Um, 
I'll do a partnership where, you know, they're just doing a distribution to my music, but I definitely want to be able to control everything that I'm doing and be me through all of my music. Uh, well, my latest project coming out is called Six at the Latest. And it's going to be coming out on Sunday, February 25th. And it will be available on every music platform. Uh, I prefer projects because, uh, you know, singles, you know, only last so long. I feel like, I feel like uh, albums make memories. So I like making memories with my music. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter at Dumbasego, D-A-M-A-S-E-G-O. And make sure you guys follow me everywhere else, Ali underscore Masego.